Hey everyone, Brian here, Hodges1455, coming at you with another video. Today's video, I'm going to be showing three more Strongsville Show card pickups. And this first one here is a 1955 Red Man Tobacco card of Hall of Famer Gil Hodges. And love the artwork on these. And the fact that they put the bio on the front is just really cool to me. You can set it out and enjoy the card displayed like that. And really enjoy the front and the back at the same time. I always love the, that about these cards. And I really like oversized cards. Um, without the tab, they may be a little bit shorter than a normal card. But they're um, quite a bit wider up here. So, But I really enjoy that. And more room for the artwork and the bio on the front. I think that's really cool. And that's what the back of these look like. But yeah, really happy to come across that one of my channel namesake there. And in the same stack, came across this Frank Thomas. And once again, with the artwork, you can just, in the bio on the front, sit it and enjoy it and appreciate it. They're really nice cards to display. Yeah. Same back there. But Frank Thomas, I just uh, picked up another card of him yesterday on Father's Day. So I look forward to getting that in the mail. Really enjoy collecting him. And he also fits a side PC of mine as well. He was born in Pennsylvania. And the third and final card here is a 1953 Tops of Hall of Famer Hoyt Wilhelm. Really like this card of him. Uh, was thrilled to come across this one in such great centering. Um, even the back really surprised me. Sometimes it has pretty good centering on the front. And then the back, um, it's really off-center, oftentimes even miscut. But was really thrilled with this. Example. Take it out of here. Get a closer look at it real quick. Oh yeah. Coloring and just a great, great artwork of Hoyt Wilhelm. Knuckleball pitcher. And those are always great to display as well. Well, hey everyone, thanks so much for watching and enjoy the hobby.